Bill Bowerman was probably one of the best coaches ever when it came to running. He was definitely ahead of his time, though. Um, I have a video, of course, I talked about Arthur Litterier, though, being a genius. And pretty much Bill Bowerman it was um, sort, of, uh, sort of the same way, though. But it's like, for example, like if uh, you ask me who would I rather really get coached by, Bill Bowerman or Arthur Lydiard, I would say both, though. Uh, these two men were very uh, different, but they were pretty much similar at the same time, though. You know, uh, Arthur Lydiard was more about the training philosophy, though, when it came to running, and Bowerman was more about uh, personal philosophy. Like, he, he, I guess you could say he mostly cared about his runners in terms of their performance and stuff and what they were doing uh, with their training, you know, certain, like, uh, who start off, you know, each of their runners different levels and stuff. I uh, don't forget, though, he made the first um, waffle sole shoe, though, using his wife's waffle iron. And, I mean, he tried to find certain ways to help runners from all different levels to improve, though. Lydia did kind of the you know the same, but uh, he was just more into like training what you got to do and stuff. I guess you could say he, uh, I'm, I've what I've read about Arthur Lydia, he was more focused on the on the training, you know. But he also did some stuff uh, that were outside. But Bowerman did more of the stuff that was like outside though, like with the training though. And of course, he was also a man about you know outside of running, you know, what kind of person you are, you know, he says if you find, uh, you know, a, a joy in exhausting yourself, going out running hard though, you know, you're also going to find other uh, joys and aspects in your life though, and uh, yeah, the Bowerman, he, he had more of an impact, especially in the U.S. and Oregon though, than Arthur Liddy, who probably had more of an impact worldwide but uh yeah if if i got ever good coach because i'm self-coach i'd pretty much do my own stuff i would have those two guys so you know i've literally you know give me what i'm supposed to do and then when i'm not doing or doing other stuff or planning scheduling stuff i'll have bowerman do that you know but again bowerman was also just yeah that other guy that was, again, it's, it's not many uh, coaches, men out there that were like that. So he was one of a kind. So <coughs> to me, yeah, Bowerman, he's, I, will, I will just take him over Lydia, though, but not much, but maybe that, that. That, that much, that much, but yeah, gotta go, gotta go and do some stuff, so, I'm out, peace.